know, right. Was there anything that you wanted to get out of him that you didn't get, or did you feel that the film is, is, is essentially what it should be? No, I feel very, very good. I'm confident that, you know, we spent about seven days together, um, constantly, uh, all day, and uh, many, many, many conversations in addition to um, the filming of the s sessions and the visits to Marinella. And I'm very confident that Enzo chose to talk about what he wanted, <coughs> what he wanted to talk about. And um, I know that I was very touched by the fact that he, Enzo's a single father whose wife died young. And that was something I was hoping Enzo would talk about. But I never felt comfortable putting that on the table because it wasn't coming up very much. He, there's a mention, and you can see it in the film, when he contextualizes M Maria and he talks about how lost he felt. And I was like, okay. Um, and then we found a way cinematically to make Maria a presence in the film and to pay homage to her. And by showing her picture with silence behind it to suggest maybe the profundity of the loss in his life. Um, so, no, there's nothing, even now, there's nothing I, I wish we had touched on something or other. I'm, I'm very grateful to him for, for, for revealing his obsession with music. Uh, I knew he was a great composer and a great singer and a great uh, musician, but the fact that he's obsessed with music, well, it makes sense when you hear the music with all these influences, but it's, I think it's delightful to see him just, just wallowing in, in his love for music.